This is Asta, and he uses the insanely overpowered anti-magic. But is it actually that OP in Roblox? Well, today we're going to be finding that out as I'm going to be spending as much Robux as it takes to unlock his 0.1% Grimoire. Now, first things first, what do I do? What is huh? this? I can't break that crystal. Track quest. Aha, I've got a quest 400 meters this way. It's kind of spooky right now. Ah, it's this guy over here. Hello, quest man. Our village is in trouble. Please help us defeat the bandits. Wait, hold on. The final boss of this is an evil old man. Man, let's take away his walking stick. That'll be good enough to defeat him. Let's do this, bandits. Wow, I'm built like a twig. Wait, I do like no damage. What? Do I have stats I can invest? Three stat points. Okay, I guess I'll do defense and strength. Can I like fight multiple of these guys at once? Oh, what's this? Is that money? Wait, how do I grab this? Do I need to get a shovel? Oh no. Wait, three at once is a bit too many. Level two, which means we got three more stat points that I'm not going to invest yet because I don't know what anti-magic is going to take. I also don't know how I get anti-magic, but I suppose for now, we'll just complete the bandit quest because surely you can just like run around and go get a grimoire right away, right? I'm about to die. I'm about to die. I'm on three HP. Okay, I'm just going to sit over here and regen. How do I regen? Well, I guess while I regen, I'll just go on a little adventure. Is there a grimoire tower looking place around here? It's a bit blurry. Oh, that looks like a tower over there. Wait, no, that's a skull. I can like barely see it, but there is a skull there. You know what? Let's complete our first quest. We'll get 500 XP for this, which is going to be a few levels, right? Let's see. Boom. Level five. Now, where do I get my grimoire? Oh, this guy has one. He has it at his hip. He came from this way. Who is this? That guy had nothing useful to say. What level are these guys? Oh, that's a strong... Oh, I found the strong bandit. You know what? Let's just run this way. I'm going to run around until I find the grimoire tower. I don't even care. Oh, that guy... Whoa, he's like flying on a sword. Where do you- He's fly- That's so sick. I need that ASAP. I appear to be lost. <laughs> Where do I go from here then? This seems like it could lead to a tower. Wait, no way. Have I actually found it? That actually looks like a tower. I just ran in a random direction. Is that guy flying as well? How- What? Okay, I need to get stronger fast. These people are kind of crazy. I'm just running around with my bare hands at the moment. Who's this? He looks very strong. All right, let's go inside. I've actually found it. Grimoire Tower. Okay. Grimoire Dealer. Oh, it's a bit of gacha. You love to see. 2,500 Robux for 100 spin. Okay. I win these. I win these. Regen. What is that? Common. I got regen again. Oh, I just know I'm going to get unlucky. Reinforcement. I haven't got anything about common. Wait, I'm so unlucky. Oh, bronze. Uncommon. Wait, what does this do? Bronze whip. That was kind of cool, actually. I mean, it's not anti-magic, so I'm not going to take it. But Oh, water. Water bomb. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Exactly as the name suggests. Oh my, I just got wind. I got 0.9% chance spin. I want to see what this wind spear does before I get rid of it forever. So this is a rag book right here. Okay, mana requirement, a little bit annoying. Also annoying how long it takes to charge. Wind spear. Right, I can see why that's legendary. That's cool. Is there a way to make this go faster? It's so slow. All right, I might have to buy this. Double luck. Let's get 15 minutes of double luck. This will increase my odds. I just know it. And I've got the instant spins now. I just spun dark. I'm feeling lucky. I got dark again. I just know that I'm going to get it and just spin off it. It's going to happen. Is my double luck actually doing anything? It's hard to tell if I'm being honest because I just spun regen like five times in a row. I've only got 50 spins left. I'm probably going to have to do a lot of spins at this rate. I got dark again. Bruh, give me something good. I got wind so fast and I haven't seen it since. All right, we got to get 100 more spins. My luck is so bad. Wait, why did it just get turned blue? Wait, did that guy just get something good? Wait, why does he keep changing color? He's got a little orb that changes color. Does that show like what he's spinning? Did he just spin something red? Oh, yes! I nearly spun off it. I've got the sword. Low Mana King has respawned. I don't know who that is. I don't care. I've got a sword on my back. My only move that I've got right now is called Anti-Magic Slash and I need strength points. So I'll just put like, basically go all in to strength. All right, I've got an anti-magic slash that I'm going to go test out on our quest giver. Oh, wow, this guy. He looks strong. Anti- I died in one hit. I just got skull emoji as well. That's the ultimate disrespect. Just you wait. I'll be back. I didn't even get to see my cool move. Now, I did put in some codes and it gave me like double XP, double yen, which I assume will be super useful. I'm not quite sure what yen is going to be used for just yet. Maybe buying like a flying sword like that guy had before. All right, now that I got a weapon though, this changes everything. Strong bandits. Level 10 required. Okay, so I got to do this bandit quest a few more times. Anti-magic slash. I one shot him. Oh my god. Anti magic is busted. I mean, these guys don't have magic, so it's kind of, you know, a little bit useless, but still. Yay, quest complete. This is actually like really easy now that I've got this. And I've got more stat points that I'm putting all into strength because if I get 100 points in strength, I think I get my second move. I assume that's what that means. I'm so strong now. These bandits never known what hit them. Hey, you don't even think about stealing my bandits. Don't even think about it. There we go, level 10. So now we can fight the strong bandits. All right, it's these guys. You know what? Let's fight all of them at once. I'm feeling a bit dangerous. They look kind of crazy, actually. 
Oh, what's that? Hold on, I need to see what that is. Let me just one shot all of these guys real quick. Anti magic slash. What is this? A timer? Oh, wait, I haven't even looked at my grimoire. Oh, it's like dirty, honestly. It needs a bit of a clean. What does this timer mean? Oh, there's a bag of Robux. How do I get this? I need to get some Robux back after I spent so much on getting this sword. All right, I should probably put some points in defense because I am starting to take a lot of damage. I've already got... <laughs> okay, maybe I went a bit too crazy. I've got 850 health. Can I fight the old man yet? Evil old man. I need to be level 20 to fight him. He's a raid boss, you could say. A level 20 raid boss. You know what? I don't want my double yen or double XP to run out, so I'm just gonna... Buy extra. <laughs> Gotta be smart about this. Wait, maybe that timer thing over there is the angry old man. Maybe he's gonna, like, respawn that. All right, level 21. It's time. He respawned. It definitely is. Is that guy in creative mode? Is he actually flying on the sword? I know Asta does that. That's very cool. I'm so jealous. Okay, I'll be able to do that soon. I don't know what level I need to get to to be able to do that, but I will level up until I can. Anyway, it's time to go one-shot an old man. Anti-magic slash. Oh, he didn't... Oh, he's got magic! What the heck is that? Wait, he's actually kind of strong. I might have underestimated this old geezer. Ow! Right. Ow. Can I block? <gasps> I figured out how to fly! Oh, whoa, whoa, don't you dare steal my kill. Mr. Dark user. He has the dark grimoire. He's trying to steal my kill. I can fly with F. That... Hey, you. You thought you're the only one? Look behind you. Oh, no. <laughs> he actually did. Wait, this is so sick. How do I actually block, though? Whoa. Whoa. He's got a wing. He's got a... Okay, that guy's way stronger than me. This mace can destroy anything. Oh, did the, uh, did the boss drop the mace? It did. Do I need to level up my sword stat considering I'm holding a sword, right? Will I do more damage? We do have a little mace now. We've got options, you know? We could throw hands. We've got a strong punch. Or we can just use our sword. All right, this boss's respawn timer is so slow. Let's try my new mace. Okay, not bad. Strong punch. Damn. All right, old man. Anytime this century, if you could respawn, please. You see, what I really like about anti-magic is I don't think I'm going to have to put any stat points in mana or magic, like at all. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop trying to steal my evil old man kill. This is mine. I worked hard for this. There we go. Four levels. Yeah, I just don't think I'm going to have to put any stats in that because I don't use mana or magic. I got anti-magic. Anyway, where do I go now? We go this way. And I can just fly there. This is so sick. All right, where's our next quest? We fly past this. Oh, what's this? I found a place. This is the church. Hello? Anybody home? Oh, there's an upstairs. Hey, yo. Storage guy. Oh, you can store stuff. That's like really not useful for me. All right, where's my next quest? This way? I found my new quest area. This guy looks, he looks a little bit worried, you could say. Maybe missed a few nights of sleep. Defeat all the more evil battles. And it's the evil nobleman. All right, I'll take down these nobles. You know, I'll do them all with my eyes closed as well. Let's do this. Every single one. And then we slash. That was easy. It's two more and we've done the quest. Any hiding over here? No, those are like different mobs. And that might be the boss of this area. All right, final evil nobleman. I'm not quite sure how many levels we got to do this quest for, but it's probably going to take a while. So let's just keep going all in strength. All right, I've made it to level 41, which I think means I can fight these desert wizards next. Not quite sure how strong these guys will be, but let's see. Honestly, they, yeah, they do a bit of damage. I can still probably one-shot them, though. Might need to start getting some more defense points going because this is starting to get a little bit rough. Anti-magic slash. Yeah, I didn't one-shot them. Wait, this is actually bad. I can't, like, one-shot them with my slash as well. I'm, like, weak now. I'm one point away from my next move. Oh, have I messed up that badly? Okay, this is fine. All right, they're all angry at me. And then we kill. That was kind of close. There we go. Here we go, here we go. 102 strength. Anti-magic hurricane. All right, let's give this a try. Hurricane? Oh, and I can move with it as well. Wait, that's good because I can move with it as well. It's kind of OP. I only need 400 more stat points to see what that final move does because I can only imagine how strong it's actually going to be. Do I need to get like a helmet on or something? Like, why am I taking so much damage? Hurricane! And then one of these. Wow, I just farmed them. Hurricane again. Hit both of them and then finish them off. Quest completes. And we're level 51 now, which I believe means we can come over here and fight the fire wizard. He's going to give us 200 yen and 15,000 XP. All into strength. Let's do this, fire wizard. Start off with a strong punch. Let's see what you're made of, huh? I'm not afraid of you. Anti-magic slash. I can't cut through his magic. Ow. Hurricane. You're done. You're done. How is he alive? How is he alive? Bro could not aim to save... Hold on. You received a drop yeah, necklace. Why? What does this do? What's 100 health? How do I equip this? I've got it equipped. Wow, I look decently cool at best. All right, 135 strength points. Not too bad. Oh, this guy's got dark. 
That's kind of cool. All right, so I suppose we just keep on grinding until we can leave this area, which will probably be about level 60, maybe, or 70. It'd be cringe if it was level 70. It was level 75 I needed. 75. I've been here for ages. But I do have a ton of points I can put into strength all the way up to 189. And I think I got, some, yeah, I got some bracelets as well, which improve my mana. We're slowly but surely becoming dripped out. Now, I do have to go 3,000 meters to go to the next place. Honestly, I'm so glad I've got this flying sword. <laughs> like, I can just get there so fast, but other people are gonna run all the way. I've made it. Do you wish to reach the skies, touch the clouds with your own hands? I can help you master the art of jumping. I can already jump perfectly fine, thank you. But it does cost 10k yen, which is kind of crazy. I don't have those kind of funds right now. We're defeating corrupt dark wizards now, who have a lot more health than anything we've fought so far. Oh, wow. They do a lot of damage as well, actually. Not super ideal, but we can, we can deal with this. It's just gonna take a while. Let's try and fight three at once. I'm feeling a bit crazy. Strong punch. Hurricane. Into a slash. Okay, three at once seems to be the limit. Why is my quest thing not going up? Oh, I was fighting the wrong ones. I was fighting enemies above my level. I'm just that different. I'm dead. Wait, was that a player that killed me? Hold on, I need some revenge. I'm about to taste anti-magic to the skull. Where is he? Hey, you. You think you can just do that and think you're safe? Think you're safe? You think you're safe? You're not safe! Get over here. Your little dark magic means nothing to me. Anti-magic slash. Yes. Corrupt wizard boss. Oh, no. Oh, no. I hit the boss. Wait, that's not good. He's got dark magic. That's really not good. I'm not even trying to fight the boss, but I'm, I'm about to beat the boss just by accident. Wind! Where'd that tornado come from? I turned to the side and there's just a tornado flying towards me. I wonder if I could cut through that with my anti-magic. That'd be kind of cool. He's gonna try and steal my boss kill. Did the boss respawn and regen? No, I don't want to find out. He was just constantly chasing me and it was kind of scary. Level 100. And I have enough stat points to unlock my next move, which is anti-magic liberation. I think because I'm level 100 as well, I can fight these, yeah, corrupt dark wizards now, which is kind of huge. There is this guy with blade magic. This is another, like, super rare drop. That's kind of cool. Uh, did I get any drop shot? Oh, I got a scarf. Plus 200 health. Upgrades. I guess we should see what this new liberation move does, I guess. Anti-magic liberation. Was that it? I mean, it was kind of cool, I guess. Sword falling from the sky. Wait. It means I've got long range now. Where's that bacon guy from before? I could do some revenge. Then again, though, I might wait until I get my final move. Oh, it does a thousand damage as well, actually. Damn, blade magic's kind of cool. Seems strong, actually. I just got one shot by blade magic. That's crazy. Seems I've got a new rival. Mr. Blade magic is the new rival. Ow. Ow. My health is just melting. All right, you guys haven't tasted liberation yet. It's time for them to be liberated. There's two bacons here. Which one's the bacon I know? Well, that's not the bacon I know. Time for you to perish. Wind magic user scum. Yes. Oh, no. Blade magic guy's back. Blade magic guy seems to be trying to hit me. Like, don't think I'm not seeing that. All right, that's level 125, which means I can face the corrupt wizard boss. I don't actually know where he is. Is it this guy up here? No. I'm stupid. He's the guy that just stood over here. All right. Liberation. I do 1,300 with that attack now. I'm, like, new and improved. I can't be stopped. Oh. Ow. Ow. Dodge. He still hurts, like, a lot. Liberation. Yes! I'm just going all in strength now. I'm gonna go all the way up. I'm honestly starting to get kind of close to the 500 strength. I'm still taking tons of damage though, which is really not ideal. Level 151. All stats into strength. I got 405 strength and only 50 defense. Wait, and because I'm 150, I think I can go to a new quest, right? Yes, I can. 1200 meters this way. Oh, wait, are we here? Oh, we're getting towards the Grimoire Tower. Commoner Bandit. So it wasn't the Commoner Bandit that defeated me before. And I can now see why I got one shot. These guys are like level 150. I am risking my life by fighting these mobs because they do a lot of damage. Quest complete though, level 154. Leveling up is starting to get real slow now. He's still on that rock over there thinking that he's the final boss. He just needs to wait till I get my 500 strength and then I will take you down. I promise. I mean, he doesn't look very amused, I won't lie. He looks insanely bored. Quest complete again, nearly level 160. I need to be level 175 for the next quest. Okay, so I'm basically gonna have to get to about level 200 to even fight that guy and get money 
for it, at least. I could probably fight him now. It'd be very tough, but then I'm not even going to get anything for it. I want to defeat yes. him, get revenge, and get paid. I'm level 176. This honestly took so long, but now I can fight bandit noblemen. But before that, I've got 10,000 yen, and I think for 10,000 yen, I could get that, like, jumping thing, I think. Is that what it said? You know, I could, like, taste the clouds or something. Back over where I just was. Behind the house, there's a man hiding. So let's see. If I talk to this guy, you already have a quest. Bruh, use double jump a hundred times. That's so annoying. I mean, I'll do it anyway, but still. He's gonna double jump all the way back to my nobleman quest. A hundred times? That's actually crazy. Well, we're almost back to the quest. What is my strength? Oh, I'm so close to this final move. I assume this final move is gonna give me that cool wing that the guy at the start had, which might be a buff. Four more jumps. Three. What am I gonna get for this? Last jump. You have awakened your jump. Oh, that's not useful. I can fly. Why do I need this? I just wasted 10k. I should have awakened my dash because I think you can do that as well. I made a mistake. Where is this quest? Bandit nobleman. Are you guys nobles? Yep, your hair is looking awfully noble. Not many of these guys even spawn in the first place, which is a little bit annoying. Oh, getting to 200 and then fighting that guy is going to be such a long process. It's going to take so long. All right, I can do this. I can do this. First quest done, we got two levels. Finally, level 201, which means I can put just five points into strength. And then honestly, I can just put the rest in defense. And now, yep, it's a transformation move. We've unlocked our final move. And also, we can get some revenge on the bandit royal, which I assume is this guy over here who one shot me at the start. Let's do this. Transform! Here it comes. <laughs> oh, I look sick. Oh, we got new moves. Anti-magic cracks. <laughs> what? Anti-magic burst? Oh my. I got put in an entire cutscene. Anti-magic break. That's the same thing. Anti-magic cracks is cool. This isn't even a fight anymore. I do too much damage. Come on, Bandit Royal. Take this. Final move. He's not dead. All right. How about that? Yes! I'm so powerful now. And I've got my fully maxed out grimoire. Now then, I think it's time for some much needed revenge on another person. Where's that bacon from before? The one with the wind grimoire who kept killing me over and over. I need some revenge. I don't think it's this guy. He's probably around here still. Bacon! Nope, that's a different guy. You know what? I'll still kill him anyway. Just for the lols. He's got PvP off. That's kind of sad. Oh, this guy. Do you have your PvP on? He's got it disabled. That's <laughs> Nobody wants to fight me. I'm too strong. Well, I guess the anti-magic grimoire is literally just the most broken thing in this game. At least, it seems that way. At the very least, it feels that way. 